traveling season is in full swing. And if you'll be spending a good amount of time outside the United States this year, then you need to have a cell phone plan that will support that lifestyle because sometimes traveling with your current plan can add up really quick with day passes that cost $10 a day and suddenly a month long trip on your cell phone bill costs $300 and nobody wants that. So in this video today, I am giving you my top three with a bonus fourth plan for traveling that should help you keep some more money in your wallet and make communicating with friends and staying up to date on social media relatively easy and simple. I'm Sherry, your telecom expert with Whistle Out. So the first plan I have to recommend comes from T-Mobile. It's $90 a month for one line and the more lines you get, the cheaper it is. It is the Go 5G Plus plan. You do get 15 gigabytes of data a month when you travel in Canada and Mexico, and that is high speed data. Once you use that up, your speeds will slow. Now, if you travel anywhere else in the world, you get five gigabytes of high speed data to use each month there as well. So if you are abroad anywhere besides Canada and Mexico, just be aware of how much data you are using because it could get chewed up pretty quickly. Another great perk for traveling with this plan is that you get free Wi-Fi access on flights where it's available from Delta, American Airlines, and United. So you can be constantly connected and you don't have to pay for any internet passes while aboard any airlines. Now, if you don't want to get an unlimited plan from T-Mobile, you want to save some money, but say you are on T-Mobile and need just an all the cart travel pass, a one-time pass or a two-time pass, T-Mobile does offer that and here are the options. Option one is $35 a month and you get five gigabytes of data and unlimited calling for t a 10 day time frame. So that is a decent amount of data for 10 days wherever you're traveling. It might be able to last you if you are frugal with that data. Now, if you need a little bit more data for a little bit longer of a time frame for $50 for a one-time travel pass, you can get 15 gigabytes of data and that will last you for the time span of 30 days. Now, now on the cheaper and smaller data side, if you just need to re-up on data a handful of times and don't want to spend the cash, you can get $5 re-ups for half a gig and that will last for three days at a time. So if you don't use a half a gig within three days, it still expires and you don't have access to it anymore, you would have to re-buy it again. But half a gig will go pretty quickly, so just keep that in mind. And just as a reminder, these travel passes work in over 215 countries. That is a lot of them, not all of them. Them. So before you travel, make sure the destination you're going is covered and you can check that at tmobile.com. My next recommendation for a good travel plan comes from Verizon. I'm shocking myself here. I don't often say Verizon is the way to go, but they have a decent plan when it comes to traveling. It's their most expensive plan. It is Verizon Unlimited Ultimate for also $90 a month. The travel perks here are pretty solid. You get two gigabytes a day of high speed data when traveling in Canada and Mexico. You also get unlimited texting and calling as well. If you are traveling anywhere else in the world with this cell phone plan, you get to have 10 gigabytes of high speed data each month, and then your speeds will slow once you reach that high speed data threshold. Now, if you are looking for a la carte options and say you don't wanna pay for the most expensive Verizon unlimited plan, you can do a travel pass add-on when you have a Verizon Unlimited plan. That pass is $10 a month and you get three full days of travel passes. Normally those are $10 each, so you are saving $20 just by putting $10 down. The third option I'm recommending is, of course, Google Fi. You can't make a list of the best travel cell phone plans and not include Google Fi's unlimited plan for $65 a month. It is just too good not to mention. Now, Google Fi's Unlimited Plus plan gives you 50 gigabytes of data, and you can access that almost anywhere in the world, plus unlimited texting and calling. The other thing I really love with Google Fi that you have to pay for with other carriers is that you get free shareable data to any smart devices like Apple Watches, or maybe you have a smart ring, or I don't know, something that would normally cost a subscription to access data you can share for free from your $65 a month Unlimited Plus plan. I really do appreciate that. I did promise a fourth bonus plan, and this one is just to save you a little bit more money, although the travel perks aren't terrific. It's from Visible Wireless, the Unlimited Plus plan. That's $45 a month 
With this, you get full use of your phone in Canada and Mexico with two gigabytes of high-speed data each day while you're traveling. That is a new perk from Visible Plus that I really, really love. So if you're trying to save money, you don't want to spend as much as some of these higher tiered plans cost, then Visible Plus is a great option, especially for visiting our neighbors to the north or south. <coughs> trying so hard. <laughs> I was trying so hard. <laughs> We're back. One other aspect of Visible Plus that I think travelers will be really interested in. Well, this is almost done and I'm not going to redo it. So let's keep on pushing through. One aspect travelers might be interested in from Visible by Verizon is that you can also buy $10 a day global access passes to over 140 countries. So full access to your phone, it costs $10. Again, $10 a day can add up if you're traveling for multiple days at a time, but it might be worth it for you. Thanks for watching. What do you think of these options? Let me know in the comments below. I'm Sherry, your telecom expert with Whistle Out. <laughs>